KDK is getting some answers after a violent weekend encounter with police on the south side was caught on camera. The video has been picking up speed on social media and the investigation by Pittsburgh police is getting more attention. Royce Jones is learning more about that tonight. Royce. Well, Ken, with the increased crime on Carson Street based on the social media video, those who oversee police conduct in the city are unclear. Was their response appropriate? Answers they hope to get with help from the public. In about one short but troubling minute of video captured on the south side this weekend, the person who pressed record tells me she walked over for food from the Cambodia Can kitchen and saw much more than the grill heating up. Through the window, the recording shows this group of people coming to blows in the corner. It appears two men throw several punches towards somebody on the ground. Then several officers rush over, tossing one of the men out of the way, seemingly trying to break up the brawl. But what they do next is not sitting right with some who saw the video on social media. While the video doesn't show everything, it does show officers throwing fists and elbows. The witness I spoke with was unsure why things escalated. I shared this with a representative from the Independent Citizen Police Review Board, who explained in cases like this, <laughs> context means everything. Well, it's hard to have any reaction other than something happened and it, it uh, attracted police attention. And whatever it was, we don't know the whole story from that video. It's very difficult. I watched it second by second by second. Pittenger believes police body cam footage is crucial here and hopes witnesses share more video and background of the incident with the board through a sworn complaint, which will help them determine their next move. If in the alternative, there is additional video that outlines further what transpired and does raise concern, then I will follow through with it um, as an executive director's complaint. And we'll determine, you know, from there, if something untoward happened, or at least we can have a conversation with the Bureau of Police. So if you were there and you have any information that you can contribute, we'll tell you who to call on KDKA.com. Just look for that story after the show. Reporting live downtown, I'm Royce Jones, KDKA News.